Hi, my name's Simon from Motordrome. Now today we're going to take a walk around and a drive of this rather magnificent uh, 1972, I think, um, Land Rover Series 3 Lightweight or Air Portable as they're known. Two videos, one walk around, one driving, plus a bit of engine starting and idling action at the end. Hope you like them. Okay, let's take this uh, rather lovely 1972 Land Rover Lightweight for a spin. Um, showing 84,000 miles. Yeah, I think so. Um, all light ignition light come on as they should. Starts really smartly, starts nicely hot or cold. This one's a 12 volt model, it's not 24 volt. And off we go. Now I have to say I've just driven it a few miles and it drives exactly the way a lightweight should. You might get some rattling from the um, from the camera mount because it's mounted on the uh, side window. And they are a bit noisy because there's no soundproofing whatsoever in them. a lot but in fairness it's so cold at the moment we're not going that far so that's probably right but the gearbox is nice it's the proper series 3 full synchromesh gearbox on this one Thank you. 
also because it's fitted with um, larger tyres via Goodrich TAs, I suspect the speedo is slightly under reading. Same, we're doing 30 miles an hour now, I think we're probably doing close to 40. It's just really, really good, this. It really is. Anyway, next up is um, a video of the underbonnet uh, starting and idling. Right, quick video of start up and idling on this uh, Land Rover Lightweight. All light and mission light coming as they should. And it starts nicely. The ignition light won't go out until you're actually moving, in fairness. If I give the throttle a blip, it goes out. And we'll have a look under the bonnet. And here we are on the bonnet, with the engine idling nice and warm. There's a very, very slight tick from the exhaust. Very slight. You see it's all in lovely shape under here as well. Very, very correct. We'll fully rewired. Just a super example.